Our Alberta spruce keeps getting these brown patches that almost have a webby substance binding it. I've tried cutting it out, but as you can see, it comes back. Any ideas? And this is Dunn and Shelley from Magnet Cove, Arkansas. Um, so any idea? You think uh, that could be? possibly be spider mites. Yeah, I would spider check mites. Uh, and then make sure that, uh, that that's the problem. You may have to use a chemical spray to control the spider mites. Uh, it, it could be disease, but uh, and continue to cut that out yeah. uh, on it. Uh, try to promote regrowth with some fertility uh, on the plant. Yeah, I think that's good. Yeah, Alberta spruce. Yeah, I mean the fact that you got it to grow is pretty good. You know, in yeah. Arkansas, <laughs> number one. Uh, number two, yeah. So yeah, spider mites is what that is. That's actually a heavy infestation of spider mites. Uh -huh. Anytime you see webbing. I mean, you have a lot of spider mites, yeah. for sure. Mm -hmm. and, and I'm probably thinking those are the spruce spider mites. Right. You know, you usually see those early in the spring or late in the fall, mm -hmm. right? Um, I would have to use, you know, of course, an oil. Right. So I would use, you know, the horticultural oil. You can still use neem oil or something that you can use. Read and follow the label on that uh, and see if that helps you out. Yeah. yeah. See if that helps you out. And then I would just keep cutting back to dead yeah. um, because spider mites have piercing, sucking mouth parts. You know, of course, they're feeding on those needles, taking the sap out cause the stippling uh, there. So yeah, read and follow the label and I think that would help you out. Hope you enjoyed the video. We would love to get more questions from you. So be sure to leave us some comments.